Well, the summertime heat is dominating the region and you can expect more during the rest of the summer. And what a lot of people notice is that this time of year we tend to get more tired than usual. Mm -hmm. Fox 44's meteorologist Haley Fitzpatrick explains why the heat makes us so tired in this week's weather wise. I'm taking that. Summertime means more time outdoors, especially by the pool or doing yard work. You may notice after being out and about on a hot day, the heat can really wear you out and make you crave an afternoon nap. But why do we feel so exhausted being out in the heat? Your body is constantly working to maintain its internal temperature. And when the weather brings in loads of heat and humidity, your body goes into overdrive to keep you cool, maintaining that internal temperature, which can make you feel extremely tired. Sweating is your body's coping mechanism to combat overheating. In order for you to produce sweat, your heart rate increases and so does your metabolism, which can zap massive amounts of energy from you. Sweating not only helps you stay cool, but it also rapidly dehydrates you meaning you're losing more fluids than what's being replenished. The harder you work outside in the heat, the hotter and sweatier you are, the more dehydrated you become, which only worsens your fatigue. Not only is the heat making you so sleepy, but being in direct sunlight does as well. UV radiation from the sun causes sunburns and skin damage. When you get a sunburn, your skin cells are working hard to repair the damage on the outer layer of your skin, which also depletes your energy as your body works overtime to reverse the sun damage. It's beyond important to keep yourself hydrated with fluids and replenishing yourself with electrolytes because heat exhaustion or heat stroke starts with dehydration. If you have any other questions about our major heat wave or anything weather related, send them to me and your question may just be featured on our next WeatherWise segment. In the studio, I'm meteorologist Haley Fitzpatrick, Fox 44 News.